everyone, my name's James Ivey. Oh, I'm Paul Drew. From the Studio Rats. Ah, uh, yes, what the hell is this? Well, as I've been saying quite a bit recently on videos, in the eternal quest that is tone, we've been buying and selling some amplifiers. Uh, some stuff has left my studio, and you found this on the glory of eBay, and I thought, that has got to be worth the very definition of a cheeky punt. What do you call me? A cheeky punt. Um, it's... Yeah. <laughs> this, it, that is incredible. This is a modulus amplification, Griffin Talon, 50 watt, single channel amp head. A company that I've never heard of. Nope. And this came up on eBay for you and you bought this. This is... It is a hand wired... Point to point. Point to point, hand wired, beautiful thing. We will show some pictures. Yep. Um, a lot, I mean, this is along the lines of you look inside and you think Cornell, you think, you know, those beautiful <laughs> pictures of the well, Plexi, Matchless. Yeah, the Plexi right. 7 that we sure, know, sure. That introduced us to Dennis. This thing's awesome. That's, it's really good. <laughs> So, what have we got? So channel one, um, the two channels are identical. They share the same tone stack, they share the same gain, um, EQ structure. Mm -hmm. The first channel has a low and high gain input, so if you want that kind of clean, super clean tones, you can get them. Not tones that Marshall Air Scamps are normally known for. you can make channel one the full filth. Or you can kick on ye olde foot switch and go. suspects when it comes to EQ so you've got bass middle and treble but each of the controls has its own kind of three-way toggle selector for EQ you know what's happened what? you've turned up with an amplifier we know nothing about it we know nothing about the actual controls and we're trying to bullshit our way through a video so what's new <laughs> <laughs> right so let's yeah because we probably should have done our homework a little bit more on this what happened was, James brought it over, we plugged it straight in and went, it sounds incredible, let's, let's do a video. So we have a bike control, um, which is similar, certainly similar sounding to a presence control. A presence. And sonically, at the other end of the things, we have a dampening control, which is much like a cut, cut control. It's like a, a cut control on, a, on an AC30, which you don't normally get on a, on a Marshall style amp. I like it for the open. Especially the Les Paul, that's great. Okay, a kick, in the, kick in the channel. We've then got twin gains, twin channel master volumes, and the EQ. I mean, what's not to love? I prefer fat one, full low mids and full high mids. 
because that to me is just giving us the full Baines Marshall. And we're not even driving an EQ hard. If you do what you do to a Marshall. That sounds like a Friedman BE100. It's yeah. at least as good as a Friedman and a British amp. Yeah. Now, modulus are quite interesting because they do sell amp kits and all the bits to make amps, but they also say, so I've got this three base, so I don't entirely know the backstory, but they also will build an amp for you as well. So th these. Well, you could build your own amp by looks yeah. of, by looks of their website. You can actually yeah. You can you can buy amp kits and if if you are that thus inclined, it's one of those things I'd like to do one day, but but valve technology scares me because of the voltage involved. But don't you think don't you think a company like this is it's complicated because they're 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 a company that sells amp kits, mm -hmm. but they also make amps. Yeah. It's a little bit chicken and egg. Well, it's not a chicken thing, but it's yeah. It, it's like well, you can buy one of their amps, or you can, but you, um, you can't buy the kit of this. No, because that would be cannibalising your own market. But that's almost like what they're doing. I mm. think they should stick to making amps. They're incredible. Um, there are obviously variations on Tolex finish, piping, colours, all that sort of stuff. This is the red one. I quite like it. Um, bit different. It's not this little normal gold Marshall style panel, but to be honest. Who cares when it sounds like that? I want it. Really? I want it. That is awesome. Wow. That is that is one of the best amps I think I've ever heard. That is incredible. Wow. Praise indeed. There we go. So I have bought a couple of good amps in the past then. <laughs> yeah, that is that was a killer buy. Yeah. So, um Guess what? What? The patches or the captures will be available on the Studio Rats website, the studiorats.net, and very soon on IK Multimedia's Tone Net. You you bought on you bought a beauty there. Well done, mate. That is absolutely fantastic. So I uh, hope you got something out of this video. It was a bit of a mismatch of a video, but Thrown together, I think. Is thrown the together, <laughs> thrown together, good. But if you did get something out of it, don't forget to like and subscribe, click on the bell button, and you'll be notified of any future video that comes out from the Studio Rats. I'm Paul. I'm James. And we'll see you next time.